On May 28, 1946, Manuel Acuna Rojas was inaugurated as the last president of the Philippine Commonwealth under the American regime. More than a month after, on July 4, Rojas was once again sworn, this time as the first president of an independent Philippine Republic. Manuel Rojas was born on January 1, 1892 to Rosario Villaruz Acuna Rojas of Capiz. His father, Gerardo Rojas, also from Capiz, died eight months before Manuel's birth. Hence, he was raised in the household of his maternal grandfather, Don Eliotario Acuna. He first attended public schools before he was sent to Hong Kong. However, he got homesick and um, suffered from bullying, so he was sent back home and graduated in Manila High School in 1910. In 1913, he finished law from the University of the Philippines and graduated on top of his class. In the same year, he topped the bar exams with a grade of 92. In 1917, Rojas became a member of the Municipal Council of Capiz. In 1919, at the tender age of 27, he was elected governor, and in 1920, he was elected a president of the Governor's Convention. In 1921, he married Trinidad de Leon after a whirlwind courtship, and they had two children, Ruby and Gerardo. In 1922, Rojas was elected to the Philippine House of Representatives, and for 12 consecutive years, he was the Speaker of the Lower Chamber. He served as member of the Constitutional Convention in 1934, and later as Secretary of Finance and in many other government corporations and agencies. During World War II, he served as a guerrilla and military leader until he was captured in 1942 by the Japanese forces. He then served as Chief Advisor to Jose P. Laurel while secretly helping the guerrilla movement. He was returned to the military service by Philippine Commonwealth Army at the start of the liberal campaign against the Japanese. After the war, Rojas formed the Liberal Party and he became its presidential candidate during the last presidential elections of the Commonwealth period. He had the support of General Douglas MacArthur, but he campaigned heavily and eventually won against the incumbent president, Sergio Osmeña, in a slim margin. On July 4, 1946, the Philippines finally obtained its independence, but the country was suffering badly. From the effects of the war, um, this and as well as other problems like the hook, insurgencies wore him out and he died on April 15, 1948.